Fortnite's Big Bang event has ushered in a new era of the storyline, and while we got our first look at how beautiful the Omniverse is, I couldn't help but notice one thing was missing. This will have a massive impact on the lore over the next few years, but for now, here are 18 unsolved mysteries in Fortnite. As we landed on our new island for the first time, it was made pretty clear that Peely has been kidnapped. He was taken by an unknown group known as The Society, and are holding him for ransom, but why? Well, in the trailer, you could see where they took Peely from, an underground room where they were investigating the society. The underground are Jones's secret task force, and I guess the society didn't like them snooping around, so they have taken Peely as a warning. The storyline of this season will be rescuing him, but at the moment, we have no idea where they took him. The only evidence right now is in this motel room, where Peely was kept hostage here while they interrogated him. The society also has some weird ties to Midas, with their logo showing a fully golden eye covered in hands. It's likely a coincidence, but people won't stop bringing this up. Up. Definitely a mystery to consider. So that begs the question, what is Agent Jones up to? Sure, he set up the underground and is on a quest for vengeance, yet he got here on a time machine. Last season, Jones was on a totally different mission, one that involved extraction. Sloan sent him to the past for a reason, but that is still a complete mystery. All we know is that he was meant to extract something from Chapter 1 without changing the future. We don't even know if he completed his goal. The last time we heard from Sloan was before the live event, where Jones strapped the time machine to the rocket and prepared for liftoff. If that event made you feel nostalgic, just wait until you check out Event Wars. We have brought OG Fortnite events to life, all happening in real time as you battle it out with classic Zone Wars gameplay. Get ready for the monster and robot to tower above you as they fight for the second time. Avoid the rising flow of lava from the volcano's eruption, or risk your builds being destroyed by Kevin the Cube and our biggest creative launch yet. We are doing a $5,000 giveaway split between whoever achieves these ranks first. So play Event Wars now using the code on screen or by clicking the link in the description. Now this leads us to the Big Bang event where there wasn't much storyline to look at. I'm sure it was extremely beautiful and the reveal of chapter 5 modes was mind blowing, but when it came to explaining the story, that's where pieces are missing. One of these mysteries was an unseen reality that stuck out among the others. With strange space pods, giant cranes, and scientific buildings, it seemed out of place. It flew past us in seconds and so we had no chance to truly get a look at it, but there is two possibilities here. Some fans have suggested this is the save the world reality. Until you look closer, you can see the head of Mecha Team Commander along with a huge jetpack. This, along with the futuristic technology, makes it appear as Reality 659, also known as the homeworld of the Paradigm. She vanished in Chapter 3 after the Fracture event, and we have known for a while now that her homeworld is super advanced. We also spotted a glimpse of it in the Chapter 4 trailer where she's on a snowy planet, similar to the reality in the Big Bang. And that also begs the question, what happened to the time machine? It teleported us through all these different realities, but this was mostly because of the zero point. After all, how would a time machine be responsible for traveling through dimensions? As the rocket launched, you could see the machine doing its work, transforming the rocket through time into objects like a nutcracker before it finally rifted away. Then, multiple rockets came out of portals, and we didn't know which one was the original. It's impossible to tell, and honestly, it might be a good thing. We all know how time travel could ruin stories. All of these mysteries are unsolved so far, but the greatest of all asks, what about the zero point? The Big Bang completely reset this thing, taking us through all of those realities. After it resets, you can see it spiraling into yet another black hole, sucking in everything around it. We visit other realities while this is happening, but near the end of the vent, we don't see it again. Now, personally, I think the zero point just returned to the Fortnite island, but but you never know. Its location hasn't been revealed yet, and the point of the Big Bang was, well, to create entirely new realities, both literally and metaphorically. Speaking of the future, we already have an idea as to what next season's theme will be. It's codenamed Aiga, which is a Greek word, and in the recent survey skins, players spotted a ton of characters from Greek mythology, such as Hermes, Cerberus, and more. But how do we get there? I mean, right now we're literally watching Agent Jones track down a secret agency, so how could this possibly lead us to ancient Greece? It is a total mystery and may involve the return of the time machine, which has already had an effect on the current island. Off the coast, you can find a small area full of artifacts from Chapter 2. There's Brutus's helmet, Sky's pinboard, Meowsel's ball of yarn, references to the agency, I mean this thing goes on and on. It's mostly from the Midas era, which is of course one of the most popular Fortnite seasons and could be hinting at their return in the future. In fact, the storyline is already seeping into other modes, like Lego Fortnite. IO bunkers have been spotted around people's worlds, leading them to believe that the imagined order are in control even in realities like this one. Clearly, the LEGO residents know about the storyline, they've written books on it, like The Adventures of John Jones, Real Stories of the Imagined Order, and The Looper Trilogy. Obviously, these are just easter eggs, but it shows that the story is going to live beyond Battle Royale. 
The one thing that was missing was the mention of the seven. It's like Fortnite has completely erased them from the story. We haven't heard anything about them for almost a year now, leading to constant speculation about where they could be. The last time we actually saw them was during the Chrome season two chapters ago, and Paradigm has totally vanished as well. Amy, the scientist assistant, went on a rescue mission to try and bring them back, but that was months ago, and we have heard nothing since then. With Sloan and Jones returning for the Big Bang, it felt like it was finally building up to their grand return, but no. Are the seven getting retired or are Fortnite just waiting for a better opportunity? Okay, well technically we have seen something hinting at the return. When Kato Thorne arrived on the island, he brought a ton of artifacts from around the world with him. This included Oro's skull, Midas' severed hand, and this strange calendar that we are still analyzing to this day. It has various symbols that are connected to the seven, so does it belong to them? Or was it an ancient prophecy predicting that they would one day save reality? It's very possible this belongs to the ancients, who we know Kato Thorne has visited before. He likely wiped out their civilization and took their treasure with him. One of these was the calendar, and because the ancients are known for predicting the future, maybe they had some kind of realization that one day the Seven would rise up and destroy the imagined order. We also know that the Seven are way older than you'd think. At the start of chapter 4, the Oathbound were revealed, the first ever version of the IO before Geno left his homeworld. Alongside them, a mysterious organization were also showcased. We only know their name because of a single Fortnite blog post, the Reality Warriors. This was never mentioned again, and they never appeared in quests. It's possible the plan was for the Reality Warriors to be the first version of the Seven, especially with these statues of a cloaked woman. Speaking of, if you remember the Chapter 2 end event, you might recall the Foundation saying, Why does she make me keep saving you? This line has been unexplained for years now, and we all thought it was building up to the reveal of the statue's identity, only for nothing to happen. Have the Reality Warriors been retconned, or will they finally be explained in the future of Chapter 5? Also on that note, whatever happened to Sloane's sand powers? When she was revealed to be alive, she had a brand new suit with no explanation of how she got it. But if you looked at this design in her concept art, Sloane had superpowers allowing her to control sand. Obviously, it's pretty funny that she woke up in a jungle the opposite of a desert. And if we're speaking of biomes, there's one unsolved mystery that we still need to explain. Throughout all of Chapter 4, leakers discovered files related to molten rock and lava. If paid attention to the layout of Mega City, you notice that a volcano was sitting right next to it. Everything pointed to this eventually erupting and destroying the city. And as you know, nothing happened. These files are still unexplained to this day. Personally, at the a lot of chapter 4 was changed at the last minute, and I have the receipts to prove it. Concept Art recently dropped a Brutal Bastion and what it was supposed to look like. Obviously concepts change, that's the point of them, but someone at Epic specifically put a sea monster, dragons, and a kraken frozen in ice. Clearly they were meant to appear on the map, and when developing the POI, plans must have changed, but it will always leave us wondering what could have been. That's not the only time Fortin has changed the story at the last second. While making Fracture, it was supposed to be super different. The final product was a result of a rush deadline, and caused major events to be cut, a like, an entire cutscene. They accidentally left this in the file, showing the mothership abducting the Zero Point before it fought back and flew away. I accept this as canon because without it, Fracture really doesn't make any sense. I love how we get a sneak peek at Epic's plans. I hope more deleted scenes get released in the future, especially if they could finally lay Fortnite's biggest mysteries to rest, like the strange reality from Chapter 2. During Zero Crisis, we watched a photorealistic world show up for a split second. It was a blink and you miss a moment, but they clearly made this as some kind of teaser for the future. Despite that, we never saw it again, and if you look closely, you'd see people praising the sun like in Dark Souls. This remains one of the oldest mysteries in Fortnite, and the list has been piling up ever since. That's everything unsolved, it's been Tommy, and keep it here on Top 5 Gaming.